this patient here, she had a BBL about a little over three years ago here with me. And then as happens, not uncommonly, she ended up getting pregnant and she just, she's got an eight month old child at this point. Let's see what, what it looks like after having a child. Maximal projection. We want this line to be smooth. Not everyone lipos in the key area. Okay, so I get a question asked uh, quite often, like, well, what happens if I were to have a baby? What it, what's it gonna do to my results? And so here's a good example. She had a very good result to begin with. Keep in mind, she's not a large person, but she had gained over 30 pounds and she had a nine, nine pound, right? Mm -hmm. nine, pound, nine pound, three ounce baby. So it wasn't as if she just shot out like a little five pounder. I mean, she had a full, full grown baby. And so we're looking at her and she's uh, 10 pounds heavier uh, than she was before getting pregnant. So she's a little bit heavier than she was, but she's happy with her weight and, and she likes it. And I think she looks amazing. Her, her just overall shape is just still really nice. I mean, it's quite something you can actually see her muscle still here. Um, flex your ab abdomen uh, so you can see like she's you know really in good shape with these nice hollowings here she didn't have any etching or anything you know her shape is still fantastic uh, everything nothing has gone to disaster um, and and the main point is that if you're at a certain weight you get a you get your result you can have a child to do everything else but if your weight gets back to close to where you were before your body is going to go back to about where it was and that's exactly where she is. I'll show you some things that have changed. I'm gonna have to turn all, all the way around here. She really doesn't have any more excess skin, which is really pretty amazing uh, to have a nine pound baby and she doesn't need a tummy tuck. She doesn't have, but she's got a little skin looseness. And so we see that afterwards. There's not too much. There's a lot of things on the market for skin tightening, but there really aren't anything that works really well. And I think it's completely unnecessary for her she was kind of saying like, oh, I need to get rid of these. You know, you can never get rid of the excess skin we have in this area because we need this to be able to bend. So she, she feels that she has a little bit more here and she's, she said, I want to get back to the gym, but I'm, I'm you know, I, I'm looking after eight month old, so it's become difficult for her. You know, the only other thing that we can find other than laxity is that she said, well, this is a little bit deeper than what it used to look like. And I think what she's really saying is she actually has some rectus diastasis. So what is rectus diastasis? Rectus diastasis is just a spreading a part of the rectus muscles. So when she, when she was, you know, before she had a child, she was like this. And then when she, had, when she got pregnant, they moved apart. Or maybe nine pounds, I don't know, something like that. And then they come back together, but they don't always go right back together. And she said that this line used to kind of come down more with her belly button. And she's, she said, I kind of lose it a little bit now. So things change with the abdomen. You can see she's a little bit more hollowed out here. She's got some asymmetry, not to the fat and to the skin over line top, because this is all about the same. What it is, is it's her abdominal wall. And her abdominal wall, the underlying musculature has changed a little bit. You know, that's one of the things when we do a tummy tuck, we go in and we re repair the diastasis. We bring the two muscles together. Does she need to have that done? No. I mean, her abdomen still looks fantastic. She noticed the difference. I'm a surgeon. I'm looking here. But nobody is going to be looking at that. That, that you know, if she had come to me and said, hey, I had a child. I want to have this repaired. I would just say, I really don't think you need it. I wouldn't bother going through all that work. And she doesn't need a tummy tuck at this point. And she's planning on having another child too, once she recuperates. <laughs> the, the, and it's just, now at eight months, it's just gonna get more, wait till they start really moving. That's when everything changes. You know, it, it's always been interesting to me over my career as to what happens to patients after pregnancy. And, and I, I can tell you many, many, many times I've seen different um, results. Some of them are shocking. I actually had a patient, I think it was two weeks ago that was here that had multiple children and, you know, looking at her breast, looking at her tummy, you would never even know she had one child. 
I told her like, you're very rare. Like your skin is ridiculously good. But you know, sometimes patients will get pregnant and their breasts will have a significant change and their tummy will still look really good or vice versa. Somebody's breasts look great after having a child and you wouldn't even know that they had a child if you're just looking at their breasts, but then their tummy is like loose with excess skin. So there's always going to be some changes, but I think the main point is accepting some tissue laxity here is you know totally reasonable if that's the main consequence after having a child i think everyone would take it but you know she's worked very hard to get back to her prepartum weight or very close to it and if you do that the results in the shape will be essentially the same because when you do a bbl we've removed the fat the fat can't come back to those areas where we've removed the fat and the fat that's in her butt that survived after her recovery, it's still there. So that fat is not going to just disappear. Your BBL is not going to just go away after having a, uh, a child. So thank you so much for, for allowing us to film and do this. And you look great. You should be so, thank you so much. please. You look fantastic.